New at 6 o'clock, the Charleston Police Department is finding new ways to crack down on drunk and impaired drivers. Yes, they are. An officer is being recognized by the state for his dedication to keeping Charleston streets safe. News 2's Katie Augustine spoke with that officer in a story you'll see only on 2. One Charleston police officer making it his mission to save lives by getting drunk drivers off the roads. Recently released numbers by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration show a 14% spike in alcohol-related deaths from 2019 to 2020. You're going to look down at your foot, your elevated foot, keeping your legs straight and your arms down by your side. You're going to count out just like this, 1,001, 1,002. Keeping the streets of Charleston safe from impaired drivers. There's always people driving and there's always people drinking in the city of Charleston every single night. That's the goal of Charleston police officer Zach Azari. Traffic stop. It was something I became interested in and something I became proficient in as well. Officer Azari spends every shift on DUI enforcement. He made 118 DUI arrests in 2021, landing him two state awards. But it's not about the numbers. It's more about me making an impact because every, I think of those as people's lives that I saved. According to the State Department of Public Safety, half of all fatal crashes in South Carolina last year involved an impaired driver. And South Carolina is the 10th highest state for impaired driving deaths. I would say every single night you could find it, an impaired driver. Officer Azari walked me through some of the standardized field sobriety tests he uses on the job daily. But there's a lot of things that Azari looks for before ever pulling a car over. The main one is speed. So speed is what kills. It's Azari's expertise and dedication that's not only an asset to the Charleston Police Department, but an avenue to keep drivers safe. They don't have to do that. They can, they can take an Uber. It's a lot cheaper than getting a DUI. In downtown Charleston, I'm Katie Augustine. Count on two.